Okay, guys, I want to talk here to you about the gelatin. The gelatin that we're consuming here. Okay, some of us have been consuming this. We've been talking about the cows and the pigs. Well, well, that's what gelatin is, yeah? Look it up for yourself, yeah? Gelatin, yeah, is in things, yeah, like, it's in many products. It's in many products, okay? All right? You know it's in some of the sweets, yeah? It's in many products. Look it up. Okay. So, 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 you, you want to understand, all right? You want to understand then, all right? When you, when you look it up and all the stuff we've been talking about with cows and pigs, you want to understand what contain, contain gelatin, if, if you're against that, yeah? The cows and the pigs thing. Okay, it's, um, it's, 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 it's more, yeah, than just the animal's welfare. That's important. But we know what they've been doing to the cows and the pigs. Yeah. We know what they've been doing with the cows and the pigs, guys. And uh, we, re we researched this. And, yeah. Research it for yourself. Okay, research it for yourself. Not gonna take responsibility for what you for what you take from this channel, yeah, at any point. Okay, the information, yeah. I'm gonna be responsible for what you do you decide to do, you you actions, yeah. You must um you must govern yourself. But the gelatin, okay, which comes from the cows and the pigs, is in the sweets and it's in many of the other products. Yeah, so not only are you digesting this, you are likely to be absorbing this, you are likely to be smelling like this too. Just saying, yeah, just saying. So, so, yeah, we're talking about some foods here and body odors and we're going through natural beauty and, and stuff like this, yeah. But the gelatin, yeah. This is not halal, yeah. It's not halal. Do you have to be a Muslim to eat halal? No. It's not like that, but we understand what's going on with the pigs and the cows, yeah? So that might be something that you're considering, yeah? Maybe something you're considering. Maybe, maybe I can look into what the halal is and what the gelatin is and... Yeah, we, we were just saying, we, we recently found, yeah out that a woman was feeding her hogs it's on online it's been reported yeah she fell and she was eaten yeah and they put the gelatin and stuff yeah they put the animal they put animal products and stuff listen that's why yeah we look at Thing like maybe, maybe yourself, maybe you're not vegan. Maybe maybe you do eat other things. Yeah, do you eat other animals, but yeah, understand what's going on with your animals. Okay, and uh, understand that that's why there's products that say vegan friendly. Excuse me, understand that. I say vegan friendly, they, they tell you if they if they cruelty free too. But that's why we had to put up to say vegan friendly. I just want to say too, 
armor qualified beautician also a hairdresser yeah so i'm qualified to make these hair and beauty um video report to you and um yes um also yeah to to tell you this yeah how they sell their products to you and what you need to be looking for i'm qualified in the unit in promoting and selling products to to understand how they promote and sell the product to you you need to be checking if the gelatin is in it if you are against this okay all right okay and see where you yeah halal butchers or maybe you want to eat halal yeah maybe you can look into this for yourself yeah okay all right lovely guys yeah so for those of us here that are against this kind of thing that's going on with the animals and and the hogs and the gelatin and the cows injects into cows okay just for i let you know this